the Spanish Galleon. These majestic vessels, more than mere transport, were floating fortresses, instruments of Spain's ambition during the 16th century. At the heart of this formidable fleet were the galleons, the backbone of Spanish naval power. Their robust construction, considerable firepower, and ability to withstand the rigors of the open ocean made them the ideal choice for such a mission. The sight of these towering ships, sails billowing with the wind, must have been a spectacle both impressive and intimidating. They represented the pinnacle of shipbuilding at the time, a testament to the skill of Spanish shipwrights and the vast resources at the Empire's disposal. The galleons of the Spanish Armada were not simply tools of war, they were symbols of Spain's wealth, might and ambition on the world stage. Constructing a galleon was no small feat. It was a complex and laborious process, requiring the expertise of skilled artisans and vast quantities of resources. The process often began in the dense forests of northern Spain, where towering oak trees were felled to provide the sturdy timbers needed for the ship's hulls. The galleon's hull was painstakingly assembled, each timber carefully shaped and fitted to create a strong and watertight structure. The ships were designed with a narrow, streamlined hull, which allowed for greater speed and maneuverability compared to earlier, rounder ship designs. This sleek profile was a key factor in the galleon's dominance at sea. The main gun deck, typically located below the main deck, housed the galleon's heaviest guns, capable of delivering devastating broadsides. Above the hull rose the galleon's impressive superstructure, multiple decks housing crew quarters, storage areas, and the all-important gun decks. The Spanish galleon played a pivotal role in Spain's rise to global power during the 16th century. These ships were instrumental in establishing and maintaining Spain's vast overseas empire, which stretched from the Americas to the Philippines. The galleons were not merely cargo ships, they were also warships, heavily armed and capable of defending themselves against pirates and rival navies. This dual role as trader and protector was central to the galleon's significance. It allowed Spain to project power across vast distances, enforcing its will and safeguarding its interests in far-flung corners of the globe. The galleons, therefore, were more than just ships. They were symbols of Spain's imperial might, embodying the nation's ambition, wealth and military power. The Dragon's Teeth, Galleons in Battle. The galleon's formidable reputation was not solely due to its size and firepower, it was also a product of its performance in battle. The galleon was a remarkably stable gun platform, its robust construction allowing it to absorb considerable punishment while maintaining its firepower. This stability was crucial in naval warfare where accuracy was paramount. Despite being outnumbered, the Spanish galleons with their superior firepower and maneuverability inflicted heavy casualties on the English fleet. However, the Armada campaign also revealed the galleon's limitations. English tactics, which favored speed and close quarters combat, proved effective against the larger, less agile galleons. The men who rode the waves, the men who sailed aboard the Spanish galleons, were a diverse group, drawn from all corners of the vast Spanish empire. Captains, often veterans of numerous voyages, commanded these vessels, responsible for their ship and crew. Navigators using astrolabes and charts plotted the course, guiding the galleons across vast oceans. Below decks, hundreds of men toiled tirelessly to keep the ship running. Carpenters repaired damage, caulked seams, and ensured the ship's structural integrity. Soldiers, often armed with muskets and pikes, provided protection against boarding parties and engaged in hand-to-hand -hand combat when necessary. Life aboard a Spanish galleon was harsh and unforgiving, yet these men sailed on, driven by a mixture of duty, ambition, and for some, the lure of adventure and riches. The enduring legacy. The Spanish galleon, though eventually superseded by advances in shipbuilding, left an indelible mark on maritime history. These powerful vessels, symbols of Spain's golden age, played a crucial role in shaping the global landscape. Their influence can be seen in the development of naval warfare, the expansion of global trade, and the very notion of empire itself. Today, the Spanish galleon continues to capture the imagination, its image evoked in literature, film, and popular culture. Modern-day replicas, painstakingly constructed using traditional techniques, serve as floating museums, offering a glimpse into a bygone era of maritime exploration and adventure. The Galleon story, a tale of ambition, innovation and the enduring allure of the sea, 
continues to resonate centuries after these mighty ships first sailed the world's oceans. Please like and subscribe to the channel.